Kurt Drew. This is a training video to help you understand the YouTube gauge reading on a radon mitigation system. We have simulated a radon mitigation system here. We have a prowler fan and we have a vent pipe and the suction pipe on the system. And always, we always have the YouTube gauge below the fan, typically inside the home. Okay, so here uh, the fan is at zero water columns. We're going to go ahead and turn the system on and the prowler is going to have a pretty open flow here and the water column reading is right around 1.2 okay so the first thing i want to show you is restricting the discharge of the system i have a damper in here i'm going to close the damper of the system okay so i closed the damper what did it do to the water column reading it reduced it almost down to, to zero uh, it's about a 0.3 water column reading by dampering the discharge. So uh, in diagnosing a system, maybe it's zero degrees outside and the system has a very low water column reading, you may have an ice jam. That's what an ice jam would do to a system, okay? It's restricting that discharge. So now I'm going to open it back up, okay? And we're going to get back to our water column that we were at before. And now I'm going to restrict the suction part of the system. Watch what it does to the water column reading. See how it drove it up to two? So now we're sucking maybe on harder soil and that's driving your water column reading up. We're restricting the suction of the system. Now what's happened is your, your pressure inside the pipe has increased which has driven up your water column reading but your airflow has gone down. The performance of the system is actually uh, a little bit uh, less quality performance because you're moving less air or less CFM. So to recap on this, restricting the suction on it drives up your water column reading and drives down your airflow. And then when you restrict the discharge of the system, it's going to drive your water column reading down and it's also going to reduce your airflow of your system as well. So. Uh, so that's that's what's going on with these YouTube uh, manometers, and that's how you read them and understand the airflow and performance of a radon mitigation system. So hopefully that helps.